what is good y'all it's sunday sunday fun day hope y'all having a good weekend and uh you know what we're getting ready to start another another work week and i found a little treat to sweeten up that work week i have been looking for this all over making calls I almost ordered it from the website, but didn't because you got to pay a $10 fee to have an adult signature upon delivery. I guess that's how they get across the vape ban. They send it through UPS. So I said, nah, by the time I got done ordering it, shipping and taxes, it would have been like $45 for the cart. So didn't do that, but I found it in the shop today. And I said, where have you been all my life? Because I've been wanting to try you. Why? Because the flavors are diesel, earthy, and skunky. It's an indica hybrid. And let me tell you, I did find it. It was in a clamshell. Clamshell means that it's in this plastic versus being in a box. So like they say here, due to recent supply issues, this product may come shipped in a clamshell. Well... This came in the clamshell, and not only just a clamshell, it's an older one. It's the black tip instead of the clear tip, which I do, I try and steer away from. But I saw this and I had to get it, even though I looked on the back and it's expired by almost a month now. It expired on 420, 2022. So it's uh, expired exactly a month. Yep. Um, and I got a 10% discount on it because I said, Hey, it's expired. Look out for a brother. And he said, all right, I'll give you 10%. I said, all right, I've been wanting to try it anyway. I probably would have got it without the discount because I just wanted to try it. But you know, Hey, why not ask for a discount? Um, I did not get this at the, at my, uh, normal one where, uh, they, uh, they have these, the lowest price in town this uh, i mean i had to pay a little bit more extra for this one anyway i think it was like uh 35 and then with the discount it was 30 something so anyway now let's get on to it it's not all that i thought it was going to be you know i couldn't wait i had to open it up but it is decent well it might help if i turned it on It is decent. However, I've had better from Ricci. Snowman's better. As far as a cannabis tasting, you know, pineapple OG is better. I mean, it's definitely not bad. It's kind of what what I expected. Um, Nothing too, too special. I'm not sure why they said um, the flavor is diesel, earthy, and skunky. I definitely get earthy. Maybe a little diesel, but I don't get any skunky. And my wife said it smelled like a... Oh, I forgot what kind of bread, like a fresh baked, some type of bread, she said. Which I don't get that flavor. And I don't get skunky either. Maybe I had the bar set a little too high for this. Maybe my hopes were a little too high. Maybe I'm not getting the full, the full flavor because it's expired. No, I doubt that. These are these are probably, this is probably what it tastes like. I'm sure it is. It's only expired by a month. But it does um, does have a good effect. Relaxed, sleepy. I don't really get that. I, I just felt good. You know pretty energized um relaxed calm i would say you know it's it's not i'm not gonna buy another one of these 
I'd rather have Tahoe OG or, or the Wi-Fi OG or Jack Hare than, than this, honestly. It's, I would give it a flavor, flavor wise, I would give it a, probably a four out of 10. Some people might give it a six out of 10 or whatever. But, and maybe that's just because I'm, I'm a little let down. I thought it was going to be a little more than it was. But all that being said, it's a decent card. The flavor's decent. It hits. Um, I, I don't think I'm going to get it again, though. Remedy OG. Remedy OG. Been, been trying to find this. Finally found it. Kind of let down. But it's not bad. Definitely not bad. I've had worse. Anyway, I hope y'all have a good weekend, good rest of the weekend, uh, and a good Monday to start your work week. Uh, see you tomorrow. Keep it frosty.